Whew. All right, I hope this goes by fast. I don't have time for this. I don't, don't like, don't do that. Pick it. <laughs> I don't know about this now. I swear if this don't turn out right, I'm gonna be so mad. I don't know. I really feel like this is gonna turn out ugly and I'm gonna be mad the whole day. <laughs> Please say a prayer. Please, thank you. Oh God. Ah. Hey y'all, welcome back or welcome to my channel. So today I'm giving y'all a natural hair video. I know a couple of y'all have been asking for them. So I'm finally doing it today. Yeah, so I'm gonna be washing my hair and then I wanted to do a roller set on my blow dry hair. So I'm gonna wash my hair, shampoo condition. I might do a deep conditioner cause I really kind of need to do one. And then blow dry my hair, do the roller set and then sit under the dryer. So yeah, I've never done this before. I wanted to try this cause actually the natural hair video I was going to film was like on my curly hair, not blow dry hair uh a braid out because that's how i normally wear my curly hair when i do wear it i wear it in a braid out that's what i was gonna film i'm still going to be filming that but i really wanted to try this because i don't know i just i was just in the mood to try something new so yeah this is my hair right now this is still my silk press from february the day before valentine's day is when i got my hair silk press this is still the same hair i did curly i did some wand curls in it the other day because i was filming a tiktok if you don't follow me on tiktok you should because i got a lot of content coming up i might do like a little short video of me doing my hair this roller set on this blow dry hair i might do a little short version for tiktok of course i'm gonna give y'all the long video step by step i know y'all been asking for it anyway so yeah i'm really tired i really want to go to bed it's two in the morning but i gotta do my hair tonight so i really hope this turns out good y'all because i'm gonna i'm gonna be upset if it don't because <laughs> i got somewhere to be tomorrow so yeah i'm going to wash my hair like at the sink if y'all know how your mom used to wash your hair at the sink as a little girl like you lay up on the sink lay up on the counter and like hold your head over the sink your mom wash your hair or whatever or whoever wash your hair over the sink yeah i'm gonna wash my hair at the sink and i'm gonna show y'all everything i'm gonna show y'all the products right now just in case you know it be too much going on when i get in there and start washing because i really be trying to get over with y'all i be in there just trying to get over with anyway let's do this hair so i can go to bed i'm really tired y'all i'm really tired <laughs> but yeah if you're not already make sure you're subscribed to this channel go ahead and check below because i know some of y'all be watching and ain't even subscribed what are you doing why do you keep coming here and not subscribing don't be shy go on and click the button and also comment what y'all want to see next from me whether that's natural hair wise or just anything in general anything beauty related or lifestyle related anyway i'm gonna show y'all what i'm gonna use on my hair so i'm going to be using the aussie moist shampoo and conditioner i'll put it over here yeah i'm using the one with avocado and jojoba oil mm -hmm. and then i really want to do a deep conditioner but then i also really don't feel like it i don't know but if i get to that step and i do decide to do it i'm using the briagio i don't know how you say it my sister got me this my birthday last year um don't despair repair deep conditioning mask so yeah it's feeling a little empty i don't even know if i'm gonna be able to do this because it's really feeling a little low and i have a lot of hair and i really like to go overboard with conditioner and like deep conditioning and stuff so yeah that's what i'll be using when i wash my hair but i'm gonna walk y'all through everything i'm gonna shampoo twice condition and i'm gonna detangle my hair with the conditioner in it this conditioner rinse that out and then do this after my hair is detangled and then rinse this out the deep conditioner so that's how this is gonna go but first i need to take this down and comb my hair because i have not combed it since i curled it because i didn't want to like brush all the curls out which is probably not good but you know what are you gonna do okay so this is what we're looking like right now so i'm gonna just Take my wide tooth comb and comb this out. I really need to section my hair because, um, like I said, I have a lot of hair, which if you see my hair before, um, you probably already know that, but I have a lot of hair. My hair is long and it's insanely thick and I'll be having to wash my hair in like eight sections just to keep from pulling my hair out and, you know, stressing. Uh, it doesn't look bad combed out. I should have combed it out when I curled it because I kind of like it like this. Uh, anyway. Whatever.
if you haven't noticed a lighting change i got a new light y'all i was only using like my vanity light when i filmed but i have a new light right over here and i just love her i'll link it in my storefront <laughs> but probably under like content creator or something i'll have to make like a new list so it'll probably be under something titled that like content creator stuff content creator gadgets y'all see how big my hair is already this is just the left side and this is like i said on a silk press it's gonna be bigger than this when i blow dry it i want to give y'all a natural hair video before i put weave in i know i've been taking a break from wigs which they will be back but i'm getting braids next after this style i'm doing knotless braids so i just want to do something on my natural hair first so i can give y'all some natural hair content before i put the braids in and then when i take the braids out i'll give y'all the natural hair video on my curly hair and then we might be back to wigs after that i do have some amazon wigs as well i have like two or three over there now also go shop my website whooshiebeauty.com y'all already know Hushi Beauty lip gloss on the lips right now i'm wearing georgia peach it's like my favorite scent so yeah if you haven't shopped already go do that one thing about this light y'all it gets so hot in here okay i think we're all detangled now so that's what we're working with at the moment it's so hot in here i turn this fan on i think i'm gonna section it off um I don't know because when i get my hair washed when i'll get my silk press she don't section it off and she seemed to be having no trouble you know detangling my hair and like blow drying and stuff but i struggle okay and i'll be having to section it off so i'm gonna section off in like eight sections and then we can go wash here's the back wash day really wears you out okay especially for me like i've been needing to set aside a whole day for this so the fact that i've been moving all day got home and slept for like a couple of hours and i'm washing my hair y'all better like this video gotta use my big juicy clips i got these off amazon as well i'll put them in my storefront <laughs> Okay, I got this side section. I did four on this side, so I'm gonna do four on the other side. So yeah, boom. Okay, so we got eight sections. So yeah, let's go wash, get this over with. Also, I think I'm gonna use this while I shampoo. I wanna try using this. My mom got me this for Christmas. This little silicone scalp massager shampoo thing you know i don't know but yeah i got it in pink of course this is from amazon as well i'll link it but yeah i think i want to try this while i'm shampooing because i haven't got to use it yet so okay let's go okay y'all i don't know how this setup is gonna be hopefully y'all be able to see what i'm doing but anyway i like to put on gloves when i wash my hair it helps with slip and i really don't like product all over my hand it really gets to me so yeah yeah i'm just gonna wet my hair make sure it's fully saturated because sometimes you think your hair is wet enough and it's fully saturated it's not well just when you think you've been wetting it long enough you haven't wet it some more and then start washing i hope y'all can see for real because i don't know I'm so sorry for this angle.
Whew. All right. So I shampooed twice, so now I'm gonna put on the conditioner so we can detangle. I done lost some of my sections, they done came unraveled. I just feel like this angle is so bad. Um, So yeah, I'm gonna put the conditioner on. Like, I'm gonna just go back to my room and put that on at my vanity. So maybe I can see what I'm doing a little better. Yeah, and then detangle. Then I'll come back and rinse. Y'all see, I really be loading it up with conditioner. I need all the slip I can get. Hopefully detangling will go by fast. That's the part that really just oof, gets me. This is a new bottle of conditioner, and I would not be surprised if this 26 ounce bottle is halfway gone. Voila, so now I can detangle each section. So I'm gonna start with my left side. I think that's the thickest side of my head. So I'm gonna start over there first. So I'm gonna start with the back sections and then do the front two sections, then go to the other side. And by the way, y'all, I really like this thing. Like, I love this. It was like really getting up in there in the scalp, you know? Yeah, it feels really good. I like this, I definitely recommend it. I'm definitely using this every time I wash my hair, so. So I'm just detangling with a wide tooth comb. I hope this goes by fast. I don't have time for this. I don't. Start from the ends. I shouldn't have to tell y'all this, but start from your ends and work your way up. Do not start up here. You're breaking your hair. And when you catch a tangle, don't pull it, pick it. Don't like, don't do that. Pick it, like, till you get it all the way down. And then I'm just twisting it back up once I get it detangled. And then I move on to the next section.
Okay, so this side's all detangled. Now I'm gonna do the other side. Boom. So both sides are detangled now. I'm gonna rinse this out. Um, I know I said I was gonna deep condition, but you know how I was saying it was a little low? Yeah, I don't think it's enough for my whole head. So I'm not gonna deep condition today, which worked out anyway, cause I sure didn't wanna do it y'all. I'm ready to be done with this. I'm ready to go to bed. I still got to blow dry and roll my hair. <laughs> Even if it wasn't up in there, I still probably wouldn't have done it, so. But yeah, okay, let's rinse this out so then I can blow dry and then see if I can do this roller set. <sighs> let's do this i wrap my hair in a t-shirt instead of a towel squeeze all the water out of my hair but yeah so right now i'm just gonna be blow drying i'm going to be applying bio silk to my hair on each section before i start blow drying it just so y'all know what i'm doing so i don't have to say that when i get there yeah i'm just applying bio silk when i went to the beauty supply store to get this and he was like oh you want the big it was behind the counter and he was like do you want the big one or the little one i'm thinking the big one is like this big because i saw like the one i thought was the little one it was like this so i was like i want the little one so i'm digging through my bag trying to find the bio silk and this is it this is the little one. So anyway, I'll be putting this on each section, not like a whole lot, just a little bit on each section and then blow drying it. So let's get to it. My hair is so soft. Okay, I'm gonna start with the left side again. She's my trouble side. Time to blow dry. I have this attachment on here. I don't know what you call that, but yeah, I'm gonna be using this to, you know. Had to put this heat glove on because this thing getting hot because I'm holding it right here to you know anyway
Look how easy it's coming through, y'all. Yes, I love to see it. It's morning. The sun is up, but halfway there. Now I just gotta do the other side. Boom. Okay, my hair is blow dried, so now I just have to roll it. I'm really scared to do this because I gotta put mousse on it and I just don't know how that's gonna do on my hair. Like I said, I've never done anything like this before, so I really don't know how this is gonna work. Plus, I don't wanna mess up a perfectly good wash, cause like I said, I wanna do braids after this. I'm talking about like super soon after this. Like I'm not rewashing my hair to do the braids. So I don't wanna waste a perfectly good wash and then the style don't turn out right. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. But yeah, anyway. Let's get to rolling. Um, I watched a few TikToks about using mousse, but like don't use a whole lot and end papers, which I couldn't find no end papers. So I got styling strips. I don't even know if that's the same thing. It's probably not, I don't know. But I'm gonna just try it anyway because I don't have anything else. And like I said, I didn't see any end papers in there. So yeah, but y'all that bio silk bomb like i will never use anything else when i blow dry my hair my hair is so soft like i know people be talking about how soft bio silk makes their hair but like my hair is so soft like so soft bio silk get you some don't say i never told you nothing okay Ugh. i'm almost there i just can't oh i also wanted to show y'all my shed hair i did save all my shed hair from the very beginning when I comb my hair out before I wash my hair all the way up to now that I'm done washing and conditioning and detangling and blow drying. Here's all my shed hair. There she is. But yeah, okay. So these are the rollers that I got. I got the orange ones, the snap-on rollers, one and a half inch. I really should have probably got smaller ones, huh? I don't know. But it's six pieces in each pack. I got five packs, so I figured that should be enough rollers. I don't really know nothing about using no end papers. I don't even know how to do that or how to use them. And I really don't want to. But I already got to figure out how to use these rollers. Dang, I got the biggest one, huh? I should have got a half inch. I'm going to test it like before I put product on it and then get mad if it don't do right. And then my hair start reverting and stuff before I get it rolled up. So I have mousse. I can find it. But yeah, I got the Nairobi mousse, the Rapid Shine foaming lotion. But yeah, I'm gonna test it out first on like a dry strand. Or I'm fin actually, I'm gonna section my hair off first back into the sections that I did um, like when I washed it. I can't see what's going on in the back, but I hope it's going. Put this side up. My hair is just so soft, y'all. I love this bio silk. What, what did I do with the comb? Okay, so I have eight sections. I have 30 rollers. So I can do three rollers per section. Is that gonna be enough for one section? That's a lot of rollers in my head. Three rollers per section. That's 24 rollers in my head. I don't know, we'll see. But I'm gonna do a little test. I feel like I'm gonna need more than that. No, maybe three will be enough. So I feel like I should roll it kind of like I do like when I curl my hair like away from your face. I feel like that's the direction I should roll it, right? I don't know. But these have like little teeth. So I got these, so hopefully they'll like grip the hair. Y'all see the little teeth? So, I do a little test run. So I will do it like that. And then roll it like this and then how I clip it 
just like is it gonna stay see it's gonna fall like that which way I need to clip it in clip it from under here I don't know about this now okay hold on so down like this pulling it kind of tight roll it roll it roll it and then clip it okay i don't know nothing about these end papers now i don't know nothing about doing all of that let me see how to use them okay i think i figured out the end papers situation so let's do this i'm scared so whoa so loose i feel like that's a lot though i feel like that's a lot let me blot some of that off then i put it on my hair like this then bring this down like that let me get these papers the end paper and then put some loose on that oh my goodness Then keep on rolling. I swear if this don't turn out right, I'm gonna be so mad. Like so mad. I don't even feel like it's wrapped tight. I feel like my hair is just poofing. I'ma keep going. I hope I did that right with the papers. You know these are wrap strips so who's gonna know nobody's gonna know how would they know okay so i'm gonna split this one in two i'm gonna try to do three rollers per section I feel like these sections gonna be too big i'm trying to make it fit keep on rolling I can already tell this one not gonna be right. Whatever. I'm gonna try a different method. Ooh, y'all, I am so over this, but I don't know. I really feel like this is gonna turn out ugly and I'm gonna be mad the whole day. <laughs> I have somewhere to be and I don't know. I just feel like this is not gonna look right. But anyway, I think I have like my little method now. So I'm trying to explain it. And then I'm gonna do this side off camera. Okay, so I put the mousse on there. I've been doing it two ways. I did it the way that I showed y'all like the first time. Then I put the end paper over the ends of my hair. And then I put like a little mousse on it. And then roll it. That's the one I was doing first. And then I'm gonna show y'all the other way that I also started doing it. And then clamp it. Okay. And then the other way, it's a lot of rollers in my head. And I really want to take a nap and I don't know how I'm going to do that. Okay. I'm going to divide these this way.
So I apply the mousse. People were saying not to use a lot of mousse, but then I also don't understand how the style is gonna hold without it, but we'll see. I really picked the wrong day to be trying stuff. Okay, so the other way I would like start up here and then like wrap it like this. So then my ends are right there. And then I put the end paper here and then roll it up. So that was the other way. So yeah, I got a few left. I feel like y'all can tell how over it I am. I feel like it's all over my face. Okay, we do the other side. Ugh, I just do not have a good feeling about this. Okay. Okay, so they're all on there. Um, I don't know how it's gonna turn out. I don't know, I'm really scared cause I just, I don't know. I don't wanna be negative, but I just I just have a bad feeling about it. Like it's just not gonna give the way I thought. But um, I put some clips to like hold some of them back. Like these ones that were like just drooping in front of my face on. So I clipped them so they would stay back and then these ones over here. But yeah, so I'm going to sit under the hood dryer for an hour and I'm gonna go to sleep while I do that because that's the only time I have to sleep right now. And then I will come back when it's time for the takedown. Please say a prayer, please, thank you. Oh, also I used 26 rollers. So I only had four rollers left. These are the rollers that didn't have teeth. I don't know why they were all on the same row, the same color, the same size. They were all on the same little hook. So I assumed they were all the same. So I grabbed them, but these ones, all of these right here don't have the teeth. So I don't know how these are going to turn out compared to the ones with the teeth. That's like gripping the, you know, gripping my hair and like gripping the curls. I don't know, but yeah, I only have four left. Yeah, we'll see. I'll be back in a few hours and let y'all know. So yeah. Okay, y'all. <sighs> okay, I gotta take these down really fast. Don't mind the mess in the back. Oh God, I don't have oil. Okay. Oh, oh God, something's tangled. Oh God. Ah! Sorry y'all, I'm in a hurry. <laughs> See, I should have did how I did with this one because these, it's too much mousse on it. And the hair definitely reverted. Oh my God, it's so hot. Okay, so this is how it looks right now. Um, I'm gonna spray some oil sheen. I'm gonna put some on my hand. I really don't wanna do too much to it, y'all. I don't know. This is how it turned out. I really don't know how to feel. I don't know, y'all. I don't know. Okay, y'all, so this is the finished look. Um, I gotta go. Hate to rush off from you guys. The fan's running if you hear a bunch of noise, but this is how it turned out. I don't know. Okay. All right, y'all. So this is what I ended up with by the time the party was over. Um, it was humid outside. I did go outside a couple times. I don't know if that had anything to do with it. Um, cause my hair did start poofing, but this is what it ended up looking like after a couple hours, like two hours, if that. Yeah. Um, 
I won't say a waste of time because at least my hair was blow dried because I'm gonna do my braids and it was like a really good wash. It's probably one of the best wash days that I had but as far as the style at least I know how to do it now like if I were to attempt it again I kind of know what I'm doing a little bit but yeah I don't know if you'll be seeing me do it again anytime soon. It was worth a try, worth a shot. It was fun, it was cool while it lasted. So yeah, y'all, that's it for this video. Give me some tips or something about roller sets if you have any. But yeah, y'all, I was really over it. I really don't even care because I'm gonna do my braids anyway. But yeah, I got y'all some natural hair content that y'all been asking for. So let me know what you thought of it and let me know if you want me to keep doing more or comment some hairstyles or something to try out my natural hair. Let's stay away from dye for a minute because I'm not ready for that or bleaching my hair. I'm afraid. I don't even know if I'll ever do that. I've, I've wanted to, but I don't know. I'm too scared. I don't want to mess up my hair. But yeah, that is it for this video, you guys. I hope y'all enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel and make sure your post notifications are on so you don't miss my next video and i do have some exciting ones coming up so you definitely don't want to miss it so make sure your post notifications are on and i'll see y'all in my next video bye